everyone, Storybook Sim here, and welcome back to The Sims 4 Haunted Asylum Challenge. Uh, here we have Emma. She has just woken up for the day. Uh, if you'll remember last night, she did uh, have an encounter with her first ghost, and she did a good job kind of uh, getting to know him a little bit. And hopefully uh, we will have some more come out tonight. After she went to sleep, another ghost did come out. But I wanted her to go ahead and sleep some more and not lose her bed. So hopefully we'll have some come out tonight that we can interact with. Because uh, we need to befriend them so we can uh, help them move on to the netherworld. So she's going to have breakfast real quick. And then I'm going to have her get to work on her um best-selling author let's see she needs to achieve level four the writing skill which she's already on level three have written for 15 hours we're getting close there and write five good books we haven't written any good books yet um everyone is doing all right she needs to go pause. she's about to wet herself she's gonna go ahead and go in there anyway he was cleaning. Look, Tate. Oh, I actually need to put the others to work. Oh, whoa. What? 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 What is happening? What happened? Charlotte? Not Charlotte? How did she die? Oh, she was mortified. She was about to go hide from everybody. Wow. I was not expecting this. I wonder if we should... I mean, we could try to plead for her. I feel terrible. We're only like a couple days in. She was just having a terrible time. Here's the Grim Reaper. Oh, now we're going to have another ghost haunting us that we have to try to send off. Oh, that's terrible. Poor Charlotte. I mean, could we plead for her? No? Let's try it. Or we can wail. Let's not do that. Let's plead for her. I'm gonna do it. I feel so sad. I didn't want it to be Charlotte. I really liked her. Come on. Come on. She's just eating. Are you gonna plead with him or not? Come on. Okay. Here we go. We're pleading. We're pleading. Please. Please. Okay, what's happening? Oh, Charlotte Pike is truly gone after Emma's ardent appeal fell on death's deaf ears. Oh, whatever. Nothing else we can do. It's really sad. Wow. We have lost our first patient. Here she is. We have to find a place to put her. But for now, uh, what do we need to do? I guess we need to finish eating because we didn't. Oh, really? Really? Oh, we are finishing eating. Good job. Grim just decided he's going to have a seat and hang out here. Whatever. We're going to be rude to him. Let's come give him a rude introduction. We don't like him very much. We tried to plead with him. Oh! From across the room. From across the room, we're having a bad encounter with Grim. Um, let's trick him. You took one of our uh, roommates. We don't like that. So we're going to give you a trick. No? 
uh, trick him. Let's also uh, trick with a hand buzzer. And we're going to yell at him. Took our friend. Oh, got him. Yeah. Oh, he thought that was funny too. We don't want to be your friend. Yeah, yeah, tell him. Tell him. Flash your crazy eyes at him. Oh, he's... We're not going to apologize to him. Scare him. Uh, let's see. I don't want us to be getting along. Why is that happening? Mock his outfit. Because who wears that? Come on, Grim. Really? Come on. Mock his outfit. We're getting along too well. I don't like this. And insult him. Yeah. Can I get a good shot at these two? She looks like she's gonna cry. Yeah, you tell him. Tell him. Tell him. Ooh. Bye. I thought he was gonna, like, kill us or something. I got a little freaked out there for a second. Okay. So we need to use the toilet. Oh, she's already doing that. And then we're gonna come right a uh, playful book because we're feeling playful after uh, fighting with the Grim Reaper. I need to find a place to uh, put Charlotte. Poor Charlotte. Hold on. Let's move her. Where can we put her? Come here. We'll put her right there on the coffee table. Right in the middle of everything. Go back to live mode. Some people say live mode. I think that sounds so... I've always said live mode. So, I'm not sure why that is. What are we doing? Washing our hands. Okay, let's get over here and write. And then I need to put some of the other people back to work. Oh, I also have to delete a chair and a bed. I'll do that. Let me get everybody working. Everybody's uncomfortable. Or asleep. So I can't get them to work right now. We are desperately going to need money. Name of the book, Artsy Fartsy, It's a Gas. That is actually kind of funny, so we're going to go with it. Okay, so we have to delete a chair and a bed because we lost somebody. So we're going to sell it. At least we get the money from it. So we can pay our bills. Um, and we're going to have to take this bed away. And that's what the rules state until we're down to one sim. Or hopefully we don't get down to one sim. That would actually be terrible. Why is she so angry? She had an aggravating conversation. Who are you chatting with that pissed you off? Oh, maybe she can do an angry painting, right? Can't you do that? Yes. Get over here. Oh, she's having an offensive conversation with Tate. So they don't get along. Mackenzie and Tate. Um, I mean, it's a sad, but I guess we can still work when we're sad. Um, so let's have Greg come over here and make a horse sculpture. I try not to have Rhett and Aaron. I don't really want them to do the woodworking or the painting because they have outside jobs, so they are already contributing. So I'm not going to force them to work anymore. We're still feeling playful, writing our book. And then as soon as we're done with that, I guess we're going to come cook something. What's this? Actually, we'll eat some garden salad since nobody else is. Mm, oh, wrong person. Oh, I, gotta, I keep doing that. Actually, we're not even hungry. So we'll leave that alone. What is this? Spooky. Spooky time shenanigans. If there's anything more fun than, than sharing a joke with someone else, it's having fun at their expense. Nicely decorated, good vibes. So even with Charlotte dying, we're actually in a pretty good mood. Now we're starting to get a little bit hungry. I'm going to make her work, though, until she finishes that book because we really need the income. And then we are going to... Oh, no, the fridge broke. Are you serious? 
we're gonna have to replace the fridge because we're not gonna risk electrocuting ourselves. And then we're gonna have lunch. We will make some grilled cheese. The mood actually, I mean, it's not too bad. Tate's over here uh, just chatting with himself. Considering we had someone pass away, it's actually not too bad. Oh, look at that angry painting. All right, who was that? It was Mackenzie, right? Was it Mackenzie? I can't remember. Celta Collector. Oh, look at these two. Are we doing well? Getting along nicely. Okay, Mackenzie, sell that painting. And then we're going to have Tate come over and do a classic painting, a small classic painting. We have $721 right now, so that's not bad. I don't know what our bills are going to be, though. This is a really big house, so I'm a little worried. Oh, we have two trash plants, but I think they're both dead. Yeah. Okay. Back to Emma. She is just riding away. And then as soon as she is done, she will be... Oh, now she's going to have to have dinner. We'll do grilled cheese for dinner. And then we will be taking a shower. Boys are working hard over here. Fast forward a little bit so Emma can finish this book. Okay, we I had some sort of weird glitch. Everything froze up. So give me just a second. I want to save this just in case, and I will be right back. Okay, save the game real quick, because I do not want to lose my progress and have to start over. It's actually my second time filming this part. I don't know what the deal is, um, but I'm having some weird glitch with my display, so... Or, I don't think it's a glitch, it's technical difficulty, so I'm going to have to try to figure that out. Come on, Emma. This is taking forever, but we're about to uh, level up our writing skill to level 4, so we'll have that complete. We have written for 11 hours, probably getting close to 12. Hoping we're going to have some ghosts come out tonight. Oh, the sink's broken. I'm not messing with that right now. Okay, who painted the llama? I think that was Tate. Good job, Tate. Let's sell that to a collector. And who was it? It was uh, Greg. He made a, um, that was supposed to be a horse. It's a pile of crap. All right, let's try that again. No, he's doing comfortable. Tate is feeling inspired. Well, let's go ahead and paint then. Do another one. Okay. Did we finish? Our book. We did. Oh, the quality is excellent on this book. Yes. Yes. So, uh, please don't start a fire, Emma. Uh, once she's done with all of this other stuff, we will have her self-publish, Artsy Fartsy. That turned out really well. I'm very excited. Hopefully that's going to bring us in some good money. Here, making the grilled cheese. There we go. That actually looks like a grilled cheese. Very good. Um, that sink needs to be repaired pretty soon. But I'm going to take care of Emma's needs first. We might just have to wait till tomorrow. So she's going to have her shower. Then she wants to have some fun. Um... I might have her come kind of hang out with Tate a little bit. Maybe they can uh, joke around. Let's do some funny stuff. Maybe that will get our um, our fun up. So I really want to work on our relationships with other people in the house. Casey is just hanging out. Actually, I need to get um, some people to work. So we've got to bring that money in. 
Um, whose painting was this? I don't even... Oh, I think it was Tate. That's his inspired painting. Um, he's chatting with Emma, though. Is there somebody else that can sell this for us? Sell to collector. We'll have Mackenzie do that, and then I'll have her maybe come do a sad painting. Let's uh, do a sad painting. And then we'll have Casey come over here and do a horse sculpture. Okay, we are doing all right now. Go publish our book, and then we'll go chat with Tate. We also need to take a shower. Emma has self-published a book. She won't make as much money on selling rights to a publisher, but she will. She can we do that yet? Sell to a publisher. We'll have to try that with our next book. Oh, he's not happy. Check him with the hand buzzer. That people seem to like that. Oh, she is having fun. Okay, do an impression. Um, trick him. Whoa. It freaks me out every time when I hear it. Uh, funny. And tell a funny story. So that is getting her fun up. And then we're going to have her come take a shower while nobody is using it. And... Her energy's getting low. I'm hoping we're gonna see some ghosts here pretty soon. Mackenzie's over here doing her sad painting. Oh look, it's like a sad butterfly. And I don't think it's gonna be very good quality, but it's alright. Uh, Rhett and Aaron are at work. Bringing in that bacon. Do we even have bills yet? Actually, let me check. No, we don't. That's very good. Okay, she's feeling playful. Oh no, somebody came in the back. Really? Tate. No, it was Greg, I think. Yeah, Greg followed us to the bathroom. And we're going to be embarrassed now. But we're feeling playful. How are we doing here? So we need three more hours writing and we have to write five more good books. Um, with all the writing we have to do, some of it I may end up doing off screen just because I feel like it would be kind of boring to watch them her just write all day long. Okay, so once she is done in the shower, I think we're going to try to repair the sink because it has to be done. Everybody else is going to sleep. We're going to miss out on a bed. But maybe we'll catch some ghosts that we can hang out with. Mackenzie's over there mourning somebody. There's actually still a bed up here. We might try to catch it. I don't know. No, Mackenzie's going to go get it. Oh, he's getting it. I really, really want a ghost to come out tonight. We're getting really tired. Come on, get it fixed. We're actually a little hungry too. We might have a quick snack before bed. We'll have some orange juice. Does it, I want to see if that fills up our needs a lot. I don't know how that works with the hunger. We'll see. It's definitely not having any fun. I'm sorry, Emma, but somebody's got to clean. I mean, got to fix things because nobody else in this house will. We left part of our... Oh, actually, we can finish... Oops. No, 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 no. We have this grilled cheese over here. And it's not spoiled yet. So we're going to um, finish eating our grilled cheese real quick. Then we'll come finish repairing. Do we have to start all over with the repair? I hope not. I did not mean to cancel that out. Tate's still up. Maybe he'll come chat with us. So while he's cooking and we're eating, I wonder if we can um, chat with him. Get to know him. 
Yeah, we can. Good. So we'll have them build up their relationship a little. Oh, and she's he's not doing very good. Talk about handiness. Okay, while we're fixing things, we cannot. But we'll chat with him for a minute. We're going to trick him because we need some more fun in our life. <laughs> he liked it. Okay. Any ghosts around? Just coming for parts. Throw that away. There are no ghosts out this evening. Alrighty. But it's only 11.16, so we still have time for the ghost to come out. I'm going to have to send her to bed soon, though. But if a ghost happen to come, happens to come out, I will be waking her up. So her and Tate seem to get along pretty well. I've got a decent relationship. Still, her highest relationship was with Peter, the ghost. And maybe he'll come back out tonight. We really need some fun. Uh, let's play a game just for a few minutes before we go to bed. And then let's have uh, Mackenzie come and sell this to a collector. Who was it that was? Was it Casey? Did a sculpture, a terrible sculpture. I guess it's better than nothing. Okay, so she's going to get her fun up. We have a ton of upgrade parts. And no ghosts around. Rhett brought home $63. Aaron brought home $63. Thank you. Still no ghosts, but there are beds open. So I'm going to have her uh, get her fun up a little bit more. And then I'm going to send her off to bed. Alrighty, yes go ahead and go to sleep. So I think I am going to go ahead and wrap this part up here. I'm going to send her to bed. If any ghosts come out, I will uh, film and make sure I include that in the next part because we do need to make sure we work on that. Um, because remember with this challenge, what I added to it is we do have to befriend all the ghosts and send them off to the netherworld. So I am going to go ahead and wrap this part up, but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.